Maria Anna explores the circulatory system. Once upon a time, in a quaint little village, lived a curious eight-year-old girl named Maria Anna. She had golden hair that shone like the sun and a heart full of curiosity. One sunny afternoon, while walking in their village towards the meadows, Maria Anna decided to embark on an adventure with her wise and loving mother, Natasha. As they strolled through the meadows, Maria Anna's eyes sparkled with curiosity. She turned to her mother and asked, Mama, how does blood travel through us, and why do we need it? E. Natasha smiled warmly and said, My dear Maria Anna, let me tell you about the river of life or the circulatory system, which flows within us all. They sat by a bridge, and Natasha began her tale. You see, my precious one, inside each of us is a marvelous system called the circulatory system. It's like a network of rivers and streams carrying a vital liquid called blood. Maria Anna listened with wide-eyed wonder, eager to learn more. But Mama, how does the blood move? And why is it so important? Natasha gently took her hand and explained, Well, sweet Maria Anna, it all starts with our heart. It's like a mighty pump, beating rhythmically day and night in the center of our chest. With each beat, it sends blood racing through our veins and arteries, the blood vessels, like a river flowing through the land. Maria Anna pictured her heart, strong and steady, pumping life through her veins and arteries. What are those blood vessels? Natasha nodded approvingly. Arteries and veins are the blood vessels. Arteries are like rivers, carrying blood away from the heart to all parts of your body, carrying oxygen to all systems. Those systems rely on oxygen to make energy. If our blood didn't move the oxygen we breathe into our organs and tissues, we wouldn't be able to carry out normal functions such as moving our muscles, digesting our food, or even thinking. Blood keeps us alive. Blood is a magical potion made of tiny cells, each with a special job. Some carry oxygen, giving life to every part of us, while others help fight off illness and heal our wounds. Veins are like rivers that bring the blood back to the heart. This blood carries carbon dioxide and waste products around the body. As cells use the oxygen and nutrients delivered by the arteries, they create waste products such as carbon dioxide. Maria Anna's imagination danced with visions of little cells bustling about their important tasks. Oh, the heart is responsible for so important tasks. Natasha chuckled softly. Not only the heart, but also the lungs are involved. The lungs are like two fluffy balloons inside your chest. They help the blood get fresh oxygen so it can be strong and healthy. The blood that goes through the arteries and get rid of the carbon dioxide through breathing from the vein. Maria Anna's eyes sparkled with understanding. She could imagine the blood flowing through her body like a magical journey. Natasha hugged her tightly and whispered, You are a curious explorer, Maria. Always remember, understanding the wonders inside us is like discovering a treasure map to a world of endless possibilities. From that day on, Maria Anna felt a sense of wonder every time she breathed and her heart she knew that inside her, a magical adventure was always happening, thanks to her amazing circulatory system. And so, with the wisdom of her mother and the newfound knowledge of the circulatory system, Maria Anna's heart beat in rhythm with the river of life, knowing that inside her, a magnificent adventure awaited. And they sat there beneath the golden sky, their hearts entwined with the flow of life, cherishing this moment of shared wonder. Thank you for joining us on this incredible journey of discovery. If you enjoyed this video and learned something new about the wonders of the circulatory system, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. By doing so, you'll stay updated with more exciting adventures and educational content. Your support means the world to us, and together, we can continue exploring the wonders of our amazing world. See you in the next adventure.